Welcome to Module 2, Developing a Search Strategy. This is one of a series of instructional videos created for the Evidence-Based Practice Unit in First Year Medicine. This series of modules has been developed by Tim Ruggles and Karen Neves from the Kellogg Library. They are the liaison librarians for the Faculty of Medicine. Once you have your PICO clearly defined, your search strategy falls easily into place. This module looks at how to construct a viable search strategy. If you recall, this is our PICO framed question from Module 1. We'll use this as our starting point. It is recommended you begin your search with the disease concept and add the intervention. You could also search the comparison if there is one. It is advisable to keep your search strategy to two to three concepts. If you add too many concepts, you risk missing relevant papers. In addition to the search terms describing the topic of your search, you can limit your search to a particular study design. Doing this will give you the best evidence for a particular question. This slide shows the hierarchy of study designs for a therapy question. PubMed makes it easy to limit searches by study design. The best evidence for a treatment question will be offered by a well-done meta-analysis or a systematic review of high-quality randomized control trials, or RCTs. These types of studies find, appraise, and synthesize individual RCTs, giving a more powerful estimate of the true effect of an intervention than a single RCT could do. The next best level of evidence would be finding a single, high-quality RCT. If one fails to find a meta-analysis, or RCT, one might have to rely on weaker forms of evidence, such as non-randomized clinical trials or observational studies. The weakest form of evidence are case series reports and individual case reports. For some questions, there may be no published evidence at all. For more information on study designs, see this work. So here is what our final search strategy would look like. In this example, we've chosen to limit our searches to RCTs. To see how to run this search in PubMed, see Module 3.